I am Rachel Ramsey, ITX of Miami. I'm here with Mike Storella from SNOM Technologies. Hi, Rachel. How are you doing? Good. Glad to have you here. Um, tell me a little bit about your, your company. Well, um, we come to the show every year, and SNOM has been around for about 12 years. And basically, uh, we build voice over IP phones that use the SIP protocol. Um, so we work with a lot of VoIP systems uh, and partners around the world. And uh, what are some of the differentiating factors between what you offer? Well, uh, again, because we're so uh, ubiquitous in our approach to how we build our phones, they're built all on the SIP standard. Um, so right now, one of the highlights of the show that we've done today is to announce or re-announce our 700 series, which is three phones, the 710, 720, 760, and they've recently all been qualified to work with Microsoft Link. So, and that's a big deal because we now have the largest portfolio of phones that have been qualified to work with Microsoft. Um, additionally, the 821, the uh, 370, and the 300. Um, we worked long and hard to get that qualification with Microsoft. We've been working with them for over three years. And, it, and basically, we're using uh, standards-based SIP phones. So these phones, besides being able to do Microsoft Link, can also you know, work on different uh, SIP servers or products that use SIP, like you know, GenBand or uh, Metaswitch or Broadsoft or you know, partners like Epigee or 3CX. So it's a uh, pretty versatile new phone that we've announced. Okay, great. And uh, you're also speaking at IT Expo? Yep, uh, Friday, this Friday I'm on a panel and actually it's, the topic is Microsoft Link uh, with a, a bunch of different partners. Um, you know, we've found there's been a lot of activity in the last couple of years with, uh, and excitement, frankly, with Microsoft Link. And, you know, I think we're seeing a time of uh, adoption approaching. You know, there's been a lot of deployments, um, I think, in the IM and the chat area of Microsoft Link. And now you're seeing people turn on the voice uh, part of the system and clearly looking for an endpoint or a phone like ours to make that voice experience with Link. Uh, you know, re uh, rewardable, you know, exactly. Great. Well, we look forward to hearing you speak. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you.